In this video, I'm going to show you how you edit the SEO settings for your page and also how you change the image that shows up when you share the link. So if I was to share, so this is the page right here. If I was to share this link on social media, I want to have a nice picture show up. And the way I can check that is a couple different ways. One is I have my little super secret Facebook group here that nobody else can see. I'm the only member of it. So what I will do is I will come in here and I'll post a link and I'll see what it looks like when I actually share that on social media. So I want to make sure I have a, a picture of the ebook that I'm promoting. Another way you can do that if you don't have your own super secret Facebook group is you can go to the developers page for Facebook. It's developers.facebook.com forward slash tools, forward slash debug. So you could put in the same link in here, and I, I use this a lot also. So you would put any link that you want to see how it's gonna show up on Facebook, and you would click debug. Now I've done this before, um, but if it was a brand new link that I've never shown on Facebook, then it might take maybe five seconds for it to find it. And then it'll show um, how it sh how the open graph, it's called, how the image um, shows up on social media. So that's a nice way to check whenever you're creating a landing page. So let's go ahead and let me show you those things that you can change. You're gonna be in your uh, opt-in page. So let's leave here and go back to our funnel. So I'm in funnel, I'm in the opt-in page, and I'm in edit page. That's where I just was. I wanted to just show you from the beginning. And when you come into the page, you can actually just come right up in here and go into settings. So settings are kind of universal for all the pages in this funnel. So you can change fonts and color, like your, your default colors and everything for all the pages in your funnel. So this will change everything. But if you scroll down a bit, you will see that there is a section where you can put in a search engine optimization information. And so this is where the title shows up and the short little description. And you can see, if we go back to my debug thing, that this is where the title showed up and the description. So these are this kind of meta tag information that shows up when you share an image. So you wanna make sure that you have a compelling title and you have a compelling description. And then you can add in keywords in here and then your name. So I would put in my name, you would put in your name. And then this is where you can add any image that you want. So you just click the upload button and then you can go to your files. And this is where I have images in here. So I'm gonna uh, just leave that the way it is. So I'm not gonna change the one that I have in there. And then you can hide pages from search engines, but for a landing page like this, you want search engines to find it. And that's why we're putting in this SEO information. So we don't wanna check that box. And then this is some other sort of uh, tools that you can use for tracking. So that is how you change the SEO information and how you upload the open graph image so that you have a nice, beautiful share image whenever you share the URL to your landing page.